Sarah, and this is my dog, Freedom. She's a Labradoodle. She's about almost seven years old now. She is just a wonderful family dog. She loves to play. She loves to uh, get in the water and swim around with us. We even have a little life jacket for her. And she'll stay out there for hours just floating around. But uh, she's a sweetie. William and I like to play together. You know, inside is, is, is interesting. I'll be sitting at the ta dining room table, and she'll come and nudge me, encourage me to follow her. And then we get into this uh, roundabout game of going around in circles around the table. And uh, we just kind of wrestle around, and she runs, and I run after her. Kind of fun. Kids get into it, too. One of our favorite games that we like to play is uh, we get out in the backyard and I'll get her tennis ball and I'll throw it in the water and she'll, uh, she'll run and swim after it and come back and we'll do that time and time and time again. I'll walk away and she'll just like, no mom, I want it again, I want it again, throw it again, throw it again. So that's probably our favorite game. Freedom reminds me to play all the time. She'll come up and she'll nudge me. She'll nudge my hand or she'll bring her tennis ball or her favorite toy up to me and she'll drop it at my feet and just sit there and wait. And she won't bark, but she'll just kind of grunt. And I'll ignore her for a while and then, you know, and then she starts to bark at me and says, it's time, let's go play. Freedom is definitely my best friend and for probably no other reason that she watches over my family. When my kids get away from the house, <laughs> she gets, they get too far away from her, she comes and she lets me know. She'll bark or she'll, uh, she'll get real anxious around me, letting me know uh, that my kids are, have wandered off or somewhere where they probably shouldn't be. But she's my eyes. <laughs>